The Cheltenham Festival. Four of the best days in racing. Four of the best days in sport. It's a ritual, a celebration. Sport at the highest level. Nothing comes close. And people come from far and wide to attend this magical sporting venue. It's a busy week as well for the ITV Racing social media team who have been out and about getting a 360 experience of the Cheltenham Festival. As the runners make their way towards the Go on, then. starting point and they're sent on their way. is all the crowd support here and they're here for one thing and one thing only, the Gold Cup. it's been here at the Cheltenham Festival. The racing's been outstanding. The atmosphere is simply brilliant. And yet, the best is still to come because the prize everyone in racing wants to win is the Timoco Cheltenham Gold Cup. And for the first time, enjoy it in 360. They're being called out for the Timoco Cheltenham Gold Cup of 2017. Your big race commentator is Richard Hiles. Thanks, Edge. Yes, Tifa 2 is just having to be led in by Chester Williams and is very much on edge. It's nervous times for Lizzie Kelly here and won't make the starter's job particularly easy either. So they're taking what will be their final turn. And away they go. Proud little so to realise. Bristol the right native river. So nine fences to take in this year's Gold Cup. Champagne West and Native River continuing to force the pace. They turn out on their final circuit, encouraged by the roar of the crowd. Next time round will be the one that counts. Champagne West out in front, Native River in second place. And the pace just beginning to lift slightly. Jack Adam is in third. And now it's once again thrown open. Sizing John on the near side, Native River. And it's Sizing John who sees his opportunity. What a race that was. A first Gold Cup for Jessie Harrington. What a week she's had after Super Sunday earlier in the week for the Pots as well. And Robbie Power has won the Gold Cup. His second winner of the week. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear 